And when this property first came on the market, I went to Susan and I said, I'm not even sure this is for us, but this property is important and we need to do something about it so that it doesn't become condos or a gravel pit or solar or whatever. This is an important piece of agricultural land that this community needs to take action to save. So we've never had this type of security before. We've never had land that is ours. We've never had access to grants so we could put up a building that we might need or drill a well or put up permanent fencing. We've never been able to have that in the six years that we've been farming on our own. And that's all to come. And it's just, yeah, it's pretty amazing. And thank you all for supporting this project and the land trust and the future projects. I really believe what Molly said, that this is the model, hopefully, to move forward to do this again and again and again, because the farmers are retiring and there aren't young farmers here to take over because they don't see the opportunity here because as we know it's an expensive place to live and an expensive place to even consider buying anything so if we can be ahead of the ahead of that and say we have opportunities come and we can help you get set up then we can really continue to grow more food and be a really strong community that obviously shows up for each other so Thank you all for being here. And please, you know, I hope walk around and say hi to all the birds that are here right now. <laughs>